Choose the patient and create a new case. In the pop-up window, select the lab to which you'll send the case. On the order page, press Single Units, then Implant Abutment or Screw Retain Crown and select the tooth. Then select the Implant Connection and choose Manufacturer, System and Connection. Lastly, choose material for the implant and a crown and the shade if it's needed. Finally, set the delivery date by clicking the Delivery Date button. The Emergence Profile Scan is selected by default. This is the recommended workflow due to the ease of use, but you may deselect the Emergence Profile if you prefer to scan only the scan body. You also have the option to add a pre-preparation scan if needed. When done, proceed to the scan page. If you selected the Emergence Profile Scan, you'll now have to perform four scans. Lower Arch, Lower Arch Scan Body, the Upper Arch, and finally, the Occlusion. First, remove the healing cap, dry the area, and scan the Emergence Profile immediately, before the gingiva collapses. Make sure to get the entire area covered well. Then paint the area of the Emergence Profile using the Lock Tool. This will freeze the Emergence Profile in its current retracted state, thus preventing it from being updated with later data when the gingiva might have collapsed. Then complete the scan using the official scan strategy. Finally, mark the preparation. You'll see a blue overlay around the preparation mark, indicating the area that will be automatically cut out when going to the scan body page. If necessary, you may reposition the preparation mark to obtain your desired cutout. Insert the scan body and proceed to the scan body page in the top workflow bar. Start the scanner pointing at a neighboring tooth. Once the scanner has picked up the position, Slowly move to the scan body and circle around it to scan from all angles. It is especially important to cover the upper third of the scan body to make it possible for the laboratory to recognize the correct position. When the scan body scan is complete, remove the scan body. Move to the next page to scan the upper arch as our antagonist, following the official scan strategy. Now move to the Bite Scan page. Insert the scan tip to the second molar on the buccal side. Ask the patient to bite. Scan three to four teeth until the upper and lower arches snap to the bite scan. The light blue surface indicates the surface covered by the bite scan. The alignment is done automatically. However, if it fails, proceed to the manual alignment. Go to the Analyze page and confirm that there is enough space for the reconstruction between the upper and lower jaw using the clearance tool. Optionally, you can set the margin line. Post-processing will be done automatically when you send the order. However, it is recommended to do post-processing first if you wish to set the margin line before sending. Finally, switch to the Send page. You'll see a summary of the order. Press the Send button to send the order.